Hello and welcome back. This is the Let's Play series for The Search 2, part 16. Um, so we just ended off, we got into Gideon's Rock, we took on our first load of invisible enemies, and we came to this little, kind of like little mercenary hub where we talked to a few guys and they've gave us some quests, a bit of direction on where to go next. So, we have to activate three towers. What the actual fuck is this boss time? Whoa, what the hell? Are we meant to be trying to fight this beast? Because it looks like I am going to fail big time. God, uh, I can have to take Hamlet's shield every time. Okay. Let it take out itself. Um. What the hell is this guy? Here, yeah, running away. This isn't. Oh, triple tap. Okay. <laughs> um, all right. I'm definitely going down in this one. <clears throat> so this guy is a beast. Um, yeah. Do I need to kill this guy right now, or can I wait? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have another go at trying to kill him. So it seems like he is pretty readable. Oh no way. That's why I should go to the med bay. Okay, no worries. We can do this. Can't really sneak up on this guy. He's gonna notice me. Alright, let's back off a bit. Well, not too much, actually. He's got weapons. Um. Oh, we got this. Long Fang. So it starts off pretty. That's what I wasn't using. What was I using? I was using this. Warhammer. Uh, one, four, two. So we got one there. Let's, let's um, compare these. I kind of should have gone the other way around. Let's compare these. Uh, okay, so we've got more damage, less impact. Um, but fifteen percent attack speed, uh, less energy, more stamina consumption. Oh no, uh, less stamina consum consumption. Um, don't want you. Have a go with that anyway. Like no space at all in there. Okay, let us go back. This might be a better weapon for that 
to take on that big guy just because we'll have a bit more um, like a faster attack and hopefully we'll be able to we can't like chip away at him so we are just gonna unlock this med base so we can start back here when we die again um, let's get out of here just straight down can just literally just avoid this guy completely. But where is the fun in that? Whoa, get out of there. No! <laughs> Ah, why are you trying to dodge against the bloody computer screen? Ah, alright. Come on. We can do this. Ah, oh god, I'm sad to think this whole episode is just going to be me trying to <coughs> defeat this, like, tough... Well, it's not going to be too tough about this enemy. Oh, that's the wrong time to go at him. Oh man, this guy is absolutely killing me. What the hell was that move? Interesting. Like, I'm going to go back to this one just because it takes it. Yeah, it's got a bit more impact on it. It's going to take less um, charge attacks to take down that shield. It's a bit more beefy. I, I kind of like it. I'm going to stick with this. Oh, God. Oh, man. This, this, uh, this enemy is giving me a bit of a headache. And now he is more... Just want to get that shield down. Should probably try and... Oh, crap. Trying to learn his moveset so I can counter properly. It doesn't seem to be working at the minute. Oh, Duck Tundra. Oh, come on. This is where he does three in a... Now he gets his shield back. No. Damn you. I should have to try. Oh, a kick. Okay. Should have to try and get some uh, some counters in there. 
try to get a uh, try to get a parry and then a counter. Probably the way to do this guy. So we'll have a look anyway. I might just try and can I just go? Get out of there. Get free here. Where's my um Where have my tech scraps gone? Oh they're up there. I was like just being blind then. Yeah, it's still coming. We can. Oh, get out of the way. <laughs> and now it's got fire. Come on, you can do that. Nope. A Gaia arm plate. Oh, God. Right. <clears throat> the outer shell of Gaia gear consists of a thin layer of brass, which produces the gear's distinct look. All inner pieces are made out of a reinforced steel mixed with muscle fiber skeleton for additional mobility and power. Um, so, a three piece increases damage of continuously channeled drone attacks. And full set, one of batteries failed, gained 10 mini cells. Oh, God. So. Do we? And we looked at those. So have we got a uh, Jaguar head, a body, a crudo here. So we've definitely got some mixed pieces in there. Did we get a we Oh, interesting. <laughs> um, so I think we're going to try this for a bit. Equip. So it's got less impact. I'm assuming I probably should have like looked into this four, but impact is the chance to like get a bit of a stun from them. Uh, like you know, just a bit of a knockback when you're attacking. Um, okay, so we've got a few different areas to go through. What's up, Captain? That bastard Jack. I was eavesdropping on him. Never liked the little shit. Same here, Faye. He's plotting to kill us. Have you seen Hawk? I think he's next on his hit list. I haven't seen him yet. She'll go ballistic if she finds out. He wants to keep the reward for himself. I should have known. Why'd I have to trust that son of a bitch? Don't worry. I'll take care of it. With or without Hawk. Okay, you'll be yeah. in the Northern Repellent soon. I just soon. hope we aren't too Just late. hang in there a little while longer. Okay, so let's go to this side. <clears throat> ok, 
Okay. So this looks like like a lab where they were trying to construct all these things, experiments or whatever. And just have a little look around. Audio log. The underclass is on the rise. Radical terrorism is devouring our city. AID will strike without mercy. Segregate all agitators until we can find a permanent solution. Our field agents are authorized to carry out capital punishment on the spot. No questions asked. A critical power enhancer. While health is low, damage is increased. Trust no one. Keep your eyes open. Call us today and make Jericho safe again. AID. Attack. Insurgency. Disease. Yeah, this is. This has just gone all the way around to the beginning. Can we drop? I don't know if we can drop down there or not. I'm not just going to try it out. We're just exploring at the minute. See um, what leads. Uh, what paths lead where. We're back here. We've just come through there. We fell down that hole. And there's another guy. Uh, brilliant. Pretty sure I was attacking a leg. Let's get some health up. Okay. Uh, dodge. Uh, rubbish. They're gonna be these like big guys for the whole place. This spare. I'm just gonna take off these other weapons just so we can quickly switch between them all. We we'll take that off as well. So we just got the two weapons to switch between. Back up here. Okay, that went much better. Um, let's see what we got. Oh, a drone weapon as well. <coughs> okay. So is there, if we go to the, no. Compare. Consumes one omni cell while channeled. Produces a force beam of heat energy, dealing damage and setting enemies aflame. Pretty, sounds pretty nice. And the head schematic. What do we want from this guy? 
Take out his arm. That's just the place to drop down. Drop down there. Um, this is. Oh. A little pathway down there. We might just have to remember that place and have a look. Let's have a look at that implant. Reclamation buddy. Increases the amount of tech scraps gained by killing enemies. Brilliant. At six. Uh, <laughs> we might have to switch that out as well. Um, three. I think I might just. I like one everything else in here. Before we finish the sequences, uh, we'll leave it out for now. That'll be our next implant that we'll be putting into our rig. Just have a look at this area. Okay. Look got unlocked. Which takes us around here. We got that head. I don't know. And there you go. Just press the button and the platform moves the statue to the maintenance area. Oh, come on! Why do I have to take the stairs? That piece of junk can walk on its own. Yes. It can also kill if you let her meander around unsupervised. Remember the Jones family? Right. Thanks for bringing the statue down, by the way. Wait. I thought you brought it down. Uh, right, and there's another one there, so just a run in charge.
Okay, so they're coming a bit easier. Becoming a bit easier to take on. <laughs> New implant. Uh, kinetic inject charger. Performing and finishing sequence adds one pre-charge to the currently selected injectable. Okay, nice. Uh, do, 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 do you want to go through here? Which one I, like, I know there's the... So that's... Um, so I'm assuming that's... What's that? What's being attacked then? Oh god. So many like uh, paths to go, I don't know which one to go too fast. So we're just gonna raise this platform. Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah. Keep going then. Exactly 8 p.m. and this is Jericho Action News. Six weeks ago, a terrifying nanite-based plague known as Defrag was discovered. AID have announced the release of a new experimental drug. A spokesperson proclaimed you can feel safe at home. Uh, okay, so we came from here. We came from down there. Okay, so we haven't been up here yet. And it does not look like we can go across there yet. We need to activate the bridge somehow. Um... Alright, okay. So we've had a little look around here. We are gonna go back to base. Have a little break. Maybe try and see if we can upgrade anything. So this is MK4 already. Brilliant. Um. we got enough to do our weapon. No, nope. there's two more of those. We can upgrade some more some armor pieces, which is good. Good to know. Um but we are starting to get some of those pieces as well from these enemies. Brilliant. So I think we're just gonna what am I doing? Just gonna level up for now. Few points to place. We go around out a bit. <clears throat> right. So I'm just gonna leave this episode here for now. I'm gonna take a quick break. Uh, thank you guys for watching this far. And if you would like to show your support for the video, please. Uh, comment, like, and subscribe to the video, and hopefully I'll see you again in the next part. Okay, thanks guys, take care.